What's up gamers? Uh, Big Daddy with some hacked gameplay on World at War. Um, I've known that World at War has been hacked as COD 4 has been, but I still thought maybe I would try to get into a lobby without a hacker. Um, and unfortunately, that was un I was unable to. Um, every I played five lobbies. Every lobby had a hacker in it. All of them pretty much used the same file that they got from somebody else. And you know what? It's just a shame. It really is. Um, and I'm not going to be talking about the gameplay. It's a horrible gameplay. I, I think I even go negative. So I'm not talking about that. Um, but, you know, it's it's a shame. I just find it a shame that this this game's hacked, you know? Um, I don't believe anything's hacked on the PlayStation Network. So if you have World at War or COD 4 on the PS3, um, it's unhacked. And you can go play it, which I was almost going to go buy it, but I, and I said, no, nah, you know, it's better for me not to, um, to go buy it. Um, and why do you, what's the need for hack, for a hack, you know, if, if you don't like something, then don't buy it. It's pretty simple as that, you know, if you don't like how Call of Duty works, don't go, don't buy it. You know, um, you, this whole thing with the console war, the console wars, you know, I see videos on, you know, oh, the system's better, PlayStation sucks, Xbox rules, or Xbox sucks, PlayStation rules. If you don't like one of them, don't buy it. You know, same goes for Battlefield and Call of Duty. Oh, Battlefield sucks, Call of Duty rules, Call of Duty sucks, Battlefield rules. Don't buy the other one, just buy one. It doesn't matter. And granted, you know, that's not what I'm, ta I'm talking about. Hackers, but it, it kind of relates, you know. If you don't like something or how it runs, don't buy it. You just, ru you ruin the game for everybody else. And, you know, I know everybody has their different play style and that works for them, you know. If they enjoy sitting in a corner waiting for somebody to come around and shoot them and they think that's fun, okay, that's a boring play style to me. But if that's how you want to play, that's how you're going to play. But... Like, this hacking, um, it's called, I think, God Mode. And, um, you can't die. Unless it's by your own doing. If you hold a grenade, if you run into your own grenade, or, um, or, uh, uh, airstrike. Not an airstrike, um, whatever. It's a mortar team. Whatever it's called. I don't think it's called mortar team in World Out War, but whatever it is. Unless that kills you. You can only kill yourself. Nobody can kill you. What the hell is the point? Really, what is the point in playing? Wow, voice crack right there. If nobody can kill you, what the hell is the point of playing? You know, and and it just ruins the game for everybody else, you know? And and I and sometimes I feel bad because you know, maybe not everybody can go out and buy the newest Call of Duty, so they have to buy the older Call of Duties and then they get into this and it's full of hackers. And it's a shame because a lot of people liked World at War, including me. And I would love to still be able to play it, but unfortunately I can't play it because it's full of fucking hackers. Um, I think this is the guy. Um, you'll see he kills me a bunch of times. Um, if I just, uh, you just shoot him and you get hit markers. You'll never be able to kill him. Never. He, you just get hit markers. Um, that's bad aim by me. Um... You know, it's it's ridiculous. And the same even goes for the, the whole the Sony hack. The PSN hack. Uh, I think it was Anonymous, the group that did it. But, you know, um, who are you really punishing? Yeah, Sony lost a hell of a lot of money. But they're Sony. They're going to recover. You know, they're, they're not going to fall because of PSN being down for a month. You're punishing the the players that want to play this game you're not punishing Sony they lost money they're gonna recover like I said before they're too big at see right here see I just get hit markers you can't kill him and then I even try to knife him and it just it's like a butter knife you can't kill him um, you know you punish the players you're not punishing the company
They're going to lose money for a little while, but they'll recover. They're too big. Same would go if Microsoft got hacked and they and they lost service for a month. Um, they would still. Microsoft's huge. They're not gonna fall because of it. You're gonna punish the players that want to play the game. And um, there's a a couple hacks going around. Um, I played in one lobby where um, it's unlim. This guy had a hack where it's, it's dogs the entire uh, match. You know, just how is that fun? You know, how is that fun? It it baffles me. I just if somebody can please explain to me in the comments how this is can be possibly be fun when you can't kill somebody and then you can't be killed. What the hell? What's the point of playing? Why don't you go build your own program and you can do whatever you want? Why do you have? Why did? Why is it necessary? They ruin the game. And I just don't get it. You know? This is one of the reasons why I have not I'm not gonna buy any of the map packs for Black Ops. I'm not gonna invest a lot of it's like fifteen bucks a map pack, that's what, forty five dollars. Forty five dollars for map packs. I'm not gonna invest money into this game when it's just gonna be full of hackers in another year. You know? What's what? Why would I spend forty-five dollars on map packs? That's gonna be useless in a year. And you know, I think um, this is gonna be one of the killers of COD. You know, hackers, because a lot of other games don't have this situation, and people are gonna start thinking like me. They're gonna be like, "Well, I'm not gonna buy a map pack when I can't play this game in a year. It's pointless. It's just pointless." And you know, and I think I think another ha I think the hacker pops up here. Um, see, he just flies right through, and then I can't kill him. Why? <laughs> what the hell is the point of playing? I don't know. I just it's more. This is more like a rant instead of a commentary. But I just don't understand hackers. Um, so no more World at War. No more nothing. Just Black Ops and other and Left for Dead. Um, I put up his gamer tag at the bottom of the screen.